the kids were all thinking it was a prank because of the day it happened on. I don't think it really registered with them that it could happen here either. Shock and disbelief tonight in one small Arkansas town, a call no one ever expects or wants, a shooting at school. Thanks for joining us tonight at 10. I'm Ashley Katz. Bob has the evening off. To quickly recap what happened today, police say an eighth grade student walked into Prescott Middle School with a hidden gun. The 14-year-old then opened fire at another eighth grader, dropped the gun, and ran away. The student was quickly captured by school resource officers. Police believe this attack was planned. The victim was airlifted to a Little Rock hospital. Community, take up your cross as you call us to. That community coming together tonight, more than 150 people joined on the steps of Prescott High School, praying for the safety, also the victim and the suspect. KRK Force Mitch McCoy is live in Nevada County where people are still trying to understand what happened today, Mitch. Yeah, Ashley, good evening. When students arrived here at Prescott High School this morning, they had no idea they were walking into a day they'll likely never forget. A tragedy. 14-year-old Raul Kadera says a normal walk to class turned into a run for his life. Kid basically told him that he wasn't going to shoot him, and he shot him. The ninth grader saw it all. He says he was feet away from the fight Monday morning when an eighth grader shot another eighth grader. I just was in immediate shock for my life, and I took off running. Raul says that's when he called 911. There's a man with a gun in the school that I was running to a safe location that I was going to hide. His mom calls it unbelievable. But not here, not in a close-knit community where everybody gathers together on Friday nights for football games. And Put a hedge of protection around us. Well, the community prays. Raul says this gives him peace of mind, knowing he'll be back in the same halls Tuesday. It gave me more comfort to feel that Jesus will be with me as I go to school in the morning, as I get on the bus in the morning, as I go walk to every class. The Prescott School District says that they'll be working with the police department and they'll also have extra counselors on hand tomorrow as students return back to the classroom. We're live in Prescott, Mitch McCoy, KRK4 News.